So this is Yoshida speaking. Today, I would first like to explain the consolidated financial results for the second quarter of the fiscal year ending March 31st, 2024. Consolidated, consolidated net sales for the second quarter of fiscal year ending March 31st, 2024 was up 15.1% year over year and up 29.9% quarter on quarter to total 379.747 billion yen. Operating income was down 19.8% year on year and 3.5 times quarter on quarter to total, total 21.11 billion yen. Profit for the period attributable to the owners of the parent was down 20.3% year on year and 4.4 times quarter on quarter to total 15.958 billion yen. Net sales hit a quarterly record high. We estimate that foreign currency translations have a year-on-year -year impact of plus 16.4 billion yen in net sales and plus 15.7 billion yen in operating income. Quarter-on-quarter -quarter impact was plus 2.6 billion yen in yen, uh, excuse me, yen net sales and plus 1.8 billion yen in operating income. We made slight retrospective changes to last fiscal year's and this year's first quarter financial statements due to the PPA for Honda to Kogyo. Please note that the figures on the following pages are revised figures. Please go to the next slide. This is the summary result for the first half. Net sales hit the first half record highs as well. This is for the quarterly trend in net sales operating income and operating margin. The operating margin for the second quarter was 5.6%. This was 2.4 percentage points down year on year and up 3.5 percentage points quarter on quarter. We show the difference between the forecast as of August and actual results for net sales and operating income by business segment for the second quarter. As for the net sales of PT, although uh, sales of data centers remain sluggish, they were borderly in line with expectations due to solid growth in aircraft applications. MLS sales were down expectations below expectations due to slowdowns in data center and non-vehicle motors. SE exceeded expectations mainly in mechanical components and optical devices. AS sales exceeded expectations due to the recovery in automobile production. Operating income for PT was lower than expected uh, due to a deterioration product mix resulting from a slowdown in data center applications. MLS uh, was result of mixed depending on the product, but mainly due to the strong sales of motors for automotive applications, it exceeded expect expectations. SE exceeded expectations partly for mechanical components. AS was below expectations due to factors such as some price corrections. So uh, this is for the results of the sector minutes and starting with the position technologies. On the left is a graph indicating quarterly net sales trends and on the right is a graph with a bar chart of quarterly operating income trends along with a line chart for operating margins. Second quarter net sales increased 7.4% quarter on quarter to total 51.4 billion yen. Sales of bore bearings increased 8.2% quarter on quarter to total 37.1 billion yen. The monthly external shipment volume was up 7.1% quarter on quarter for an average of 200 million units. So, uh, this is due to the automotive related sales was uh, recovering and to the contest growth it growed. And for the data center, although it was weak, uh, we are seeing the bottoming out trend. Sales of rod and, fa and fasteners totaling 10.1 billion yen were up 4.4% over the previous quarter. Sales of pivot assembly up 7.3% quarter on quarter to total 4.2 billion yen. Operating income for the quarter totaled 9 billion yen, and the operating margin was 17.6%. On a quarter-on-quarter -quarter basis, operating income increased 10.1%, while the operating margin improved 0.5 percentage points. 
Looking at the results by part of quarter and quarter, operating income for ball bearings and pivot assemblies increased. Now let's look at the MLS segment, quarterly trend. Net sales increased 5.6% uh, 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 quarter on quarter to total 87.8 billion yen. Uh, looking at the results by product, uh, we see that the sales of uh, motors increased 4.1% uh, quarter on quarter to reach uh, 69.1 billion yen. This is mainly due to the solid sales, particularly uh, that of uh, motors for automotive applications. Sales of electronic uh, devices were up 3.7% uh, from the previous quarter to total 13.1 billion yen. Sales of sensing devices uh, totaling uh, 9.5 billion yen were up 18.1% from the previous quarter. Operating income came to 3.6 billion yen, and the operating margin was 3.9%. On a quarter-on-quarter -quarter basis, operating income has doubled. The operating margin increased 1.8% percentage point. Let's uh, uh, look at the performance uh, for the semiconductor uh, business uh, uh, semi semiconductor and electronics uh, business segment, the net sales increased 92.2% uh, quarter on quarter to total 157.1 billion yen. This is mainly due to higher sales from optical devices, mechanical components, and semiconductors. Operating income totaled 12.6 uh, billion yen, uh, while the operating margin was 8 uh, percent operating income increased uh, 25 point uh, one uh, times and the operating margin increased uh, 7.4 percentage points quarter on qu quarter this increase was mainly due to higher profit uh, brought by increased uh, sales of optical devices op uh, mechanical components and uh, semiconductors um, finally uh, let's uh, look at the uh, as uh, segment the net sales increased 5.3 percent quarter on quarter to total 77.6 billion yen this was mainly due to a uh, better uh, sales uh, to automotive oems as their production rates recovered uh, following the resolution of the semiconductor shortage while uh, operating profit the total 1.2 billion yen um, the operating margin was 1.5 percent operating margin increased 2.2 percentage points a quarter on quarter uh, the bar graph uh, here uh, shows uh, a trend in profit attributable to uh, the owners of the parent uh, while the line graph uh, chart uh, changes in the profit uh, for the per period uh, per share the profit for the period uh, was uh, 16 billion yen earnings per share was uh, 39.2 uh, yen. Uh, next is the uh, quarterly inventory uh, trend. At the end of the first quarter, inventory totaled uh, 302.8 billion yen, uh, which is 500 million yen down uh, than what uh, it was uh, three months ago. Uh, this graph uh, contains uh, a bar chart uh, showing a trend in uh, net uh, interest-bearing debt, uh, which is total interest-bearing debt uh, minus cash and cash equivalents, and the line chart indicating free cash flow. At the end of uh, the first half, uh, a net in interest bearing debt uh, totaling uh, 234.7 billion yen was up uh, 33 billion yen uh, from what it was uh, at the end of the previous fiscal year. Regarding the net interest bearing debt uh, uh, forecast uh, for the end of uh, the fiscal year, we expect our cash position to improve uh, due to our uh, higher uh, cash generating capacity. The full year forecast uh, for uh, March 2024 has been revised uh, down from uh, 1,450 uh, billion yen to 1,400 billion yen in net sales and from 95 billion yen to 77 billion yen in operating income. Sales forecast for PT and MLS have been revised uh, down due to a slowdown in the market for data centers and other applications. SC sales were also revised uh, down in light of uh, slowdowns in analog semiconductors, optical devices, and precision components. Operating incomes for PT and MLS were revised down in line with lower sales, while SE was revised down in line with lower sales in optical devices and analog semiconductors. AS forecast remains unchanged. The exchange rate assumption is 140 yen to a dollar, US dollar. This slide shows the forecast by business segment. This chart shows the difference between the revised forecast and the original forecast. This concludes my presentation.